Hello my friends, yeah this is my voice, some of you have asked me to speak, so here I am, it's the first time that I speak while riding a bike, um, and it's funny, because two years ago I didn't even know how to ride a bike, and now I speak while I ride, uh, it's unbelievable for me. I try to do my best. Oh, it goes with the red light. Yeah, it's red. No, now it's green. Okay. Well, I'm so sorry for my English. I hope you understand at least half of what I'm going to say. I don't think uh, I'll add subtitles because uh, you know I just want to show you the bike, the roads, the landscape and not overlay text that uh, would only create uh, much more confusion to my ice queen because I think that doesn't want to buy a bike and it first of all to hear the bike sound the exact note and not a man who speaks all of the time but anyway I promise that I will do something new also because someone thinks that I am dumb <laughs> no I'm not dumb I just think that everything has already been said about this bike too much people talking when he, all we want to see and here is a video without a speech but the truth is for me it's really hard to speak another language uh, while riding well this is a road that I know very well because it connects the village where I live to the city where I work and I've been working it four times a day for almost 10 years now it's a commercial street there are a lot of intersections so I won't run take the highway because I feel that uh, the bike is hot and uh, it's time to let loose a little more as you can see today is a sunny day it's a beautiful sunny day but it's cold and wet so thank you to my ex-girlfriend who gave me this black jacket uh, 10 years ago uh, I had a bike jacket but I didn't have a bike um, I remember that she told me one day you will have a bike I want to say to her darling now I have a bike and I'm finally wearing your gift after 10 years anyway I don't have a girlfriend anymore <laughs>
lot of you asked me if I had any wobbling issues at high speeds I, I always say no no issues no issues uh, on good tarmac It could be a bit unnerving when you hit bumps, but uh, on bumpy tarmac uh, the fork uh, works very well, as you can see. And uh, what else? Acceleration is smooth. question you often ask me is about long ride can GT be used as a touring bike I think not it's comfortable but seat is not well paddled for long tour to pressure on wrists full tank is too small I think it was built for other purpose Almost any bike can be used for this purpose, but touring bike commonly have uh, large displacement fairings and windshields that offer a high degree of weather and wind protection. Large capacity for tanks, for long range, um, and giants with a great deal of low end horsepower and a more relaxed uh, upright seating position than a sport bike and than a modern classic like this one.
for me my friends i think uh, that's enough for today thanks for watching let me know if you enjoyed maybe i just said a lot of useless bullshit uh, i don't know i tried uh, i i really enjoyed anyway and thanks for your support uh, you are beautiful ask me anything you know i will answer everyone subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so yet and see you soon ciao ciao